Hey, what's up everybody? Sam Parker here with my Credit Guy Credit Restoration. And today I wanna to talk about a subject that gets uh, brought up to me a lot, which is uh, parents asking, what can I do to help my uh, kids, you know, either establish credit or at least start off on the right foot. Okay, so there's a couple tips, tips and tricks that I'm gonna uh, tell you here in a second. But the number one thing that you can do for your 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 children is educate them about credit because you, you think back to it. Did we ever have credit 101 in high school? No. Do we ever have it in college? No. Now, I don't know if they teach it now, but it doesn't seem that anybody is any more educated than they ever have been when they hit the real world. So the number one thing is education, making sure that they understand how the credit you know, scoring algorithm works and you know, just how credit works because uh, again, we just were never taught it. Now comes the problem that so many of the parents don't know themselves how credit works. Well, you know, pay your bills on time or maybe keep your credit cards under 30%, but do you really know how credit works? And the answer is typically no. So what I'm gonna start doing is one night a week, uh, I'm gonna start doing a credit education uh, webinar that you can sign up for, and the link's gonna be down here below, okay? So number one thing is educate your client, or your, your children, excuse me. The number two thing, I guess, that I would recommend, and it's just a little tip or, or a trick, is that if your client, or geez, if your kid is about to get a car and you're gonna take a car loan out for the child, why not have them on that car loan as a co-signer? Okay, especially if your bank will allow it, you're gonna to have to look into that, but most of them will. And that way, your kid is gonna start establishing these, uh, these payments and this positive trade history and positive pay history on their credit report. That way, when they hit the real world, they have a, you know, an account that's already established. Now, along with that, uh, the same thing could go for a credit card, but I'm gonna caution you on, on, on any of these things that I'm suggesting is that while you can also help your kids by doing these things, you can absolutely hurt them if for some reason you would ever let those accounts go negative. So one thing I'm gonna tell you is don't you dare hurt your kid's credit because I, I've seen it way too often and, and it's, a, it's a tough hole to dig out of, okay? Um, but you could also uh, put your uh, kids on as an authorized user on your credit cards or as a user on your credit cards. And then that way, as you are making the payment, you're helping them grow their credit history. But again, the number one thing is education. Make sure they understand, make sure that they're building credit on their own, make sure that they know all the do's and don'ts. And I'm gonna put a link right down below this video uh, to the webinar that we're gonna be starting next week. Uh, again, educating you uh, on credit, which in turn, then you can educate your kids or feel free to have your kids on that webinar as well. But uh, we're gonna look forward to that and I think it's gonna help a whole lot of people. So if you have any questions, hit us up on Facebook. Uh, if not, we'll see you on that webinar. Thanks.